problem is, is that when you're engaged, everything's romantic. That's the problem. Everything. Every, have you seen engaged couples? Everything. An engaged couple, they could be dying in a plane wreck. That would be romantic. I'm so glad we had this time together. I couldn't live without you anyway. Yes, at least we had these moments. You're right. I love you so much. I love you more. All the way to the ground. <laughs> Meanwhile, all the married couples on the plane, I told you we should have taken an earlier flight. <laughs> Dear God, how long does it take you to wreck a plane? You're a professional. I'm taking off my seatbelt because I want to die, dear. That's right, the thought of facing your mother alone. I'm going to take it off and then I'm going to strangle you with it. They won't be able to prove a damn thing. At least I'll die happy. It all changes. My wife and I, uh, this is the moment we realized it had changed. We went married canoeing together. Canoeing, I know. Oh, this will rekindle the romance. No, it won't. It won't. Because <laughs> canoeing requires communication, cooperation, poison for a marriage. Here was the problem. We went married canoeing with my sister-in-law and her fiance. They're in the engaged canoe. You see the problem? The love boat working its way down the stream and around the rocks with communication and cooperation and patience and teamwork. And it... Right? The engaged canoe, the love boat. So he's, he's in the back, shirtless and steering. You're always taking off your shirt. When you're engaged, he's back there steering. She's up in front, spotting for rocks, like you do. Like, left, honey, a little more left, baby. Bit more left, honey. All right, my little navigator bunny. <laughs> Sick. <laughs> Hit a rock. <laughs> well, that was my fault. No, that was my fault. No, that was my fault. That was my fault. You're so awesome. You're more awesome because. <laughs> Making out like it's a plane wreck. Every time the engaged canoe hits a rock, they make out. <laughs> they're sick. Fish were puking. <laughs> Meanwhile, in the married canoe, <laughs> left, left, left. My God, you're a moron. Are you a moron? I'm serious. Are you? <laughs> seriously. I'm gonna try your other left mouth clown. Then we get the canoe in the water. <laughs> yeah. Now my wife, a captain in the Air Force, thinks she's a captain in the Navy all of a sudden. That's not how you navigate around a rock. Well, you said navigate. That's a big word. Aye, aye, captain. Aye, aye. Aye, aye. I would say stare, but I'm just a mouth clown. And Mary canoeing with just two hours of staring at the back of her nagging skull. Yeah. And down at my paddle, and back at her skull. Uh, yeah. You should have worn a helmet. <laughs> when the Mary canoe hits a rock, you're gonna kill us both! You got it half right. It was an accident officer. Canoe flipped over. She hit her head on a rock 17 times. Because if, if you're married, you understand. You understand the impulse to kill. But you don't, you don't kill. And that's love. It's, it's married love. It's all the proof you need when you're married. Do you still love me, baby? You woke up, didn't you? Took a half hour nap face up next to a pillow. That's my time, you guys. <laughs> <All right. laughs>